Hi guys, um, it might feel literally like it's been five minutes since I've done the last vlog. A simple equation, it's been about half an hour. I've just got back from doing it. I want to show you my sort of idiot's guide, how I put together a vlog and present it to you guys. So let's do it. When I'm doing a vlog, I basically, I make some bullet points about the idea of what the vlog's going to be about. Four in one, that was what I called the bridge. These are some of the points I brought up. Obviously we had the concrete cows, things I wanted to mention, the, the dates it was sculpted, etc. And same with the Roman villa, etc. And that's basically it. Just simple little notes. The rest of it is myself bringing it together in my own particular way. Okay, plan of action was a subject matter, which you will recall was doing the abbey which was there then we went to the spooky bridge which was here then we sort of we was intention to do the concrete cows which is there and the roman ruins which is there but we ended up doing it in a different order basically show you on the map right so we drove down we live literally five miles from here so we parked in this car park here this is where the abbey was and we've walked along here, through here to the tunnel, done a bit of filming around here, then we thought, okay, the coffee break, so we went to a KFC, which is about here, in the car, and drove along this road, you see a section of the, the, the vlog where we're in the car, just driving along here, up here, parked around the car park here, went to the Roman ruins and done a vlog around there, then walked down to a bridge area around here, and followed this path all the way along here and this is where the concrete cows are and that's after we've done that vlog that's where the vlogging ended okay everything would have been shot today's vlog would have been shot on the canon g7x mark ii which i got around christmas time brilliant little camera um i could obviously do the vlogging still on the iphone se which is this which you're watching through at the moment um, this obviously does 4K, that only, will only do a maximum of 1080p, um, but the quality of that is the, the colour, um, the actual definition that you get from a camera as opposed to what you get on the, a phone is slightly better. Okay, we're going to need to take out the SD card, which is that there. Put that another one in because we're going to film what we're doing on the phone later. The SD card from the Canon G7X I'll put into this transfer device. This was about, I think it was about £10 off Amazon for a little safety cover. And that will go into my iPhone, which is here. And then I'll switch back to the G7X to show you what I'll do with the transferring. Okay, we've attached the transfer device. And if you see here, I've got it on photos. It says import, I'll press it import now that is now you see import all on the top there that is now importing all the video clips that i've made today from the g7x onto my iphone and then i'll be able to edit those this might take five minutes okay the import is complete i want to keep that now I can detach this, take out the card, I'll put it back in the camera when I'm happy with what I've got on my phone, I'll then delete it via the G7X. Now my next step is to put in a set of earpuds, just so I can keep the noise to myself, I'll just sit there doing whatever else while I'm drinking a cup of tea, and basically mount this on a little mini tripod, so it's easy for me to handle one fill about out of it. And then it is, flip the screen round, basically, time for me to start editing about these little bits and pieces. Not that I'm going to do any cutting while I'm actually just recording, this is showing what I do. This little bar here, I can cut, chop bits out, lengthen it, short it, etc. And put them all together, and then I'll put all of the clips together then I add them together on iMovie okay I've edited all my clips and now we're going to switch over to iMovie and create project 
and we want to create a movie. So then we go through everything I have basically edited and then we simply add all these clips together and that will base our vlog. vlog. Now basically what home, we do is we'll run through we and make sure we're happy with what we've produced. South of here is where we live. Uh, right now we're going to save the video that will transfer it back into the photos on the phone is in a larger form rather than like little clips okay we've gone for the basics we've shown you how to create your video your vlog how to edit it the final part is actually on youtube on youtube yourself you get to your own page this little button here you're simply going to put in your description which is your title for your vlog and basically what it's all about. Then hit upload. It's going to take probably, depending on time, if it's, a, if it's a short vlog, it could take five minutes to upload. Anything longer than that can be anything up to 30, 40 minutes. And there you go. It's out there in the world for everyone to see. Okay, guys. I hope that has been of use to you. Um, this is personally what works for me. It's pretty straightforward, pretty simple, and um, yeah, it's a process that we all have to go through. If you want to become a YouTuber, get used to doing that. Make it as easy as possible for yourself, and as they say, I'll see you in the movies. Take care, guys. Thank you for watching. Bye.